Right, so, obviously this is the box of the Apex Maker, so let's take a look unboxing it. It should be really easy, this has got a couple of clips on each side, so it should be really easy to just unclip um, and, then, uh, and then it should just come, the lid should just come straight off, I think. So, oh, it's funny. Yeah, yep. Well, that was easy. So you can see that this is how it comes packed. So we've got nice big, uh, nice big polystyrene on the side. The box is quite thin. There's quite a big air gap. Top it's a, and it's a as nice well. big air gap so that any damage or any trauma that goes to the front. And at the ends. And there's an air gap around the sides as well, so you're not, um, if there's any damage to the box, you're not as likely to get damage directly to it. So let's get this out. All right, so I think the best way to do this to begin with is just going to be. That, that's just going to tear. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I can get my. Up on the side. No. Oh, don't let me get this out. I think I might have just uh, burst my... something. Yeah, I think I might have just pop my shoulder out. Of. Oh, that'd be two of us then. That's one nasty twinge of my shoulder. Man. So, as you can see, that's it out of the box and up. So let's take a look inside and see what we have inside of it. So, okay, so gas struts on the side, which lock into place and hold yep. that where it needs to be. Let's start taking out packaging. So that is empty. This is... Bunch of stuff there. No, that's pinned down the back. I think we're going to have to turn it on and raise that up. Oh, the peel. The peel. So. I'm not one to criticise, but <laughs> this, the X1 sticker on this is super wonky. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> okay, so I'll tell you what this screen is from. It's exactly the same UI that's on the mag forms. You turn the mag forms on, yeah. It's the same. It's the same. It's exactly the same. It's the same screen that's on our mag forms. One second, we'll show you. So this is the UI from the Apex Maker. Let's get in nice and tight. You can see really, really nice screen. This is exactly the same UI <laughs> that's on the mag forms. <laughs> Excellent. Luckily. So we go here, manual control, and we go one,
that's quicker. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Infinitely quicker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite a lot, yeah. Made a big difference. So, I don't know if you can see at the back here, we've got, uh, this is where the activated carbon filter goes. We've got a sensor that sits on the side of the vat, which I'm assuming is the auto refill. Refill the and? Drain? Drain. Right. So these screws just, so that's quite nice. So let's just bring this right Do in. like screws that don't have to come all the way out. So these screws are nice and easy to use. They're a little small, but they just screw down like that or you unscrew them and they just pivot over to the side and that's gonna let you pull your vat right out. This is the vat. It's nice and large. Which is large and deep. Pretty sure that's an ACF film on the bottom of that as well. What? So you do get a couple of spare uh, screen gaskets. This comes with a gasket pre-installed anyway. So there's really not a reason to touch that. We can pop this back in here, like, just looking to see if this has got, yep. Yeah. Couple of locator pins, puts that in there nice and securely. I do like screws that you don't have to actually remove. Yeah. We've then got here a battery IP camera, which, which goes over the back there, you can see is a nice little, uh, a nice little camera there, which does actually magnetically attach to that. Or you can use the you can use the supplied little. Uh, so this goes. This will stick on, and then this magnet. There you go. Just this just sticks on to the thing, and then there is a small USB cable right at the back here, which will let you plug in your um, which will let you plug in your camera so the camera under there this does charge and it has does come with an sd card pre-installed so that should let that got the on off buttons on the side of that and everything so that'll be interesting to see you do get a couple of fep films with another film as well so two of these i would assume are screen protectors and the rest of fep no i think some are acf and some are mfep Okay, fair enough. You get this nice little tray. So this is a little resin tray so that you can do your mo you can uh, scrape your models onto it. So you get that free. You get a flathead screwdriver and a matching metal spatula along with the obligatory. So uh, they must be the knobs for the build plate. Yeah, you've got your knobs for the build plate. You've got a scan disc USB and your plastic scraper. The tiny people's gloves, filters, and then this here is your draining kit, draining and kit, auto and, fill fill and auto filling kit as well. The plug this goes into a plug that's at the back. 